construction of a polygon. So now we are going to construct a hexagon of given side 50 mm by other methods. Earlier we have discussed by using a general method and now this is a method one. And again we are trying to use a campus. So first of all we have to draw a line of 50 mm length. So we need to consider a line AB of 50 mm length. So after taking AB of 50 mm length, so my consideration of AB will be from this point to this point only and I extend the exactly the same length, double, double of this particular length like I can say from here to here it is AB and from here to here also it will be 50 mm just an extension line I am trying to take it. Now with the center A and radius AB make a semicircle make a semicircle like this okay now this a semicircle is called as a quadrant bc so with the help of a divider divide this a semicircle into six equal parts our objective is to draw a hexagon so this a semicircle now we have to divide into six equal parts if your objective is to draw a pentagon divide this a semicircle into five equal parts okay but now here our we are going to draw hexagon so i will try to divide this one this semicircle into six equal parts like i can say 180 divided by six i'll get 30 degrees so this 30 degrees angle i have to keep okay so first i will take b as a center i'll get one mark next with one as a center with the same radius i'll get two three fourth point fifth point so that I will get six equal parts. Now draw a line joining a1 and extend. So I have to join this line and then extend this line up to some length. Okay. Similarly at this particular end a2 and extend, a3 and extend, a4 and extend. So up to four we required but this last line we don't consider for now okay next next with the radius a b whatever the radius is there from a to b so we need to take that radius on the compass keeping b as a center with this particular point as a center we need to cut this a1 extension line this a1 extension line at some point like this and term that point as B. Now with the same radius AB keep D as a center mark a point on A2 line like this. In the same radius with E as a center mark your point on third line F. With F as a center already we have got a point here I will make it off. Next, what we have to do now join the lines from A to B already we have a line next B to D, D to E, E to F, next F to G and again from G to A thus we will get a complete hexagon. Okay, so this is the hexagon which is having a six sides. Okay. So first we have to divide this semicircle into six equal parts, extend the line, take the radius and cut it on the rock and join the remaining lines. This is for hexagon.